Hey guys, the other day when we went to the museum in La Habra, wow, I've never seen an Italian market. I'm so used to seeing a Mexican market, Spanish market, even Chinese markets. The other day I went to an Armenian market, but I've never been to an Italian market and I thought it would be fun, especially since Joe is Italian and born, my brother is actually half Italian. I thought it would be fun to get a bunch of like fun snacks and try an Italian tasting challenge. This place is awesome. It has everything. Uh, yum. I see a bunch of wine from Italy and I kind of want to maybe make this into a, a wine challenge. <laughs> the second you walk in this place, it smells amazing. And by amazing, I mean amazing. Couscous. The food's so nice, they named it twice. Compliments of Pineapple Express. We're changing things up. Because there is this selection of Italian wine, I am going to go with Italian wine and cheese. What do y'all think? I'm gonna get my brother and my husband in on it. Okay, so this is the varietal we're gonna go with. They're all a Pinot Noir, a Tere del Volturno, Monferrato Rosso, and Moscato. <laughs> that one is a, I think it's called uh, Valpolicella. Cella. Cella. Oh, my Italian accent needs work. I got wine and I got cheese. And I'm leaving with a smile as I dent my car with the bottles. Okay, now the drive home. Do it for the two, baby. What's up, Mama Maniacs? I'm here with my two favorite men, other than my son, tasting Italian wine. Earlier today, you saw me go to the Italian market. All of these are Italian. Some are sweet, some are dry, some are heavy, some are light. We so we're just getting drunk? No, we're tasting. You're not getting drunk. I brought that Game of Thrones cup for anybody that wants to like empty out their vino. The two cheeses that I got, this is a... Ooh, I forgot what kind it is but they're both Italian. The first one that we're doing is Meza Corona, and it's a Pinot Noir. Meza Corona! Meza Corona. Half Italians here. They're who? How does it smell? It smells a little bit like wine. <laughs> Sniff it. I did. And swirl it. Did you get your swirl on yet? I can't get this let's Italian. See if, let's see if it has legs. Mm. I'm not seeing many legs, so that kind of scares me. So it's not going to walk away or what? I like legs. Do you? You like to put your face in between them. <laughs> <laughs> Papa Joe is a little bit under the weather. Yes. I, I personally think this is going to make him feel better. It tastes a little bit like the NyQuil I've been drinking lately. It's a smooth Pinot. Dolomites. It's a 2014 Pinot. Hey, 2014, the very good year. All right, I'm gonna try a piece of cheese. <laughs> really stinky and strong. That is some good cheese. I like stinky cheese. It's Babe, when we go to Italy, I'm gonna eat so much cheese and drink so much wine. You're gonna be tooting all over the place. <laughs> Rooting and tooting. I like the skin. The skin has been soaked in red wine. It's really good. I like my cheese whiz, personally. Gross. <laughs> hey, weeps. I like it from a squirt can. All right, y'all want to- Do they offer this in a squirt can? Negative. Uh, you can make it happen. Yeah. This is Meeps. She probably will attack me. Hi, Meep. You're making your mini mama debut. No, she's been on mini mama many times. Has but she? you don't watch my videos, <laughs> so you don't know. <coughs> yeah, she attacked me when once. When Amy was here. Oh, really? Hello. Yeah. Oh, you really wanted to dump it, huh? Both of y'all. I dumped it in my own uh, waste barrel. I, I have to edit, so I need to make sure that I'm sober. It's from the Italian Alps. Let's go uh, mountain climbing. Oh yeah, the Dolomites. Little Women LA is back March 21st, 9, 8 central. 10 day countdown, y'all. 10 day <laughs> countdown. 10 day countdown. Okay. Fondara Nel. Fondara. A, this is an Italian red wine. So it's Bola is the name and it is Valpolicella. If I'm saying this wrong, I that, apologize. That's wrong. You gotta... I've never tasted this kind of wine. Less so yappy, more pory. Come closer. No thanks. 
as close as I can get. Yeah, baby. Mm, come Ooh, closer. Look at you after one sip of wine. Let's see if there's legs. One sip of wine, she's acting cheesy. There's lots <laughs> of legs on this one. See, I can see the legs on this one. The other one, it took a while for the legs to come she's about. She's got legs. Man. What did you think when you tasted it? Uh, it tastes a tiny bit like wine. It smells like a foot that just ran through poop. It's so soft. This is a great like dinner wine. This would be a great beginner wine for somebody that wanted to try something more dry. It doesn't have a bite at all. It's very like I could drink this with breakfast. That's true. There's no bite. I like it. Yeah. Does it say the alcohol content? Drunk. Did you tell them what it pairs well with? No. Does it say? Yes. Pairs well with grilled chicken. Love it. Rich seafood. Dig it. Pork. Yeah. Your favorite. Pasta dishes. Love it. Oh, this is your ultimate. Beef and veal. And uh, flavor cheeses. They just named every single type of food group. Not really. Which one did they leave out? It doesn't go good with Cheetos. These are both from the Northeast region. Get it, baby. All right, let's keep going. Never want to hear Moscato again. You're going to hear a lot of it, baby. No. Can I please Moscato. have Moscato? Moscato mango. Okay. Let's open this bad boy. I have tasted a truckload of Moscato in my day. No way. And I've never tasted mango Moscato. How do you do these? I'm, I'm not too sure. Oh God, that's gonna fly. This is called Mama Mango. It's from Italy. Shake it softly before serving. No, 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 no. Softly. I don't think you're supposed to do that. Whoa, do not point that at anybody. I didn't. You just did it in my head. No, I didn't. <laughs> I think this is a horrible idea right now. It's gonna, you just shook it. It's gonna. It said shake softly before serving. Not before opening. It says before serving. Oh, Lord. Not before opening. Okay, bro. Use your muscles. Oh, it's coming up. Ah! Nice. Ooh, that like straight went in your nostrils. What did it smell like? Drugs. It's carbonated. Cheers to Mama Mango. Cheers to Mama Mango. Yeah, Mama Mania. Floating in yours. I know, it's the legs. Yours, too. It's the legs. That's not bad. OMG, that is delicious. That is like. The mango makes it It's good. like a sunny de delight. This is some sunny D. You know what it's like? It reminds me of like a mango mimosa. It's a mimosa, exactly. That's, but I don't even like mimosas because they taste too much like champagne. Because there's champagne in them, aren't there? No doubt. But I like this. Aren't there? <laughs> this is, this is my jam. Is it? It's like I hate pizza because there's too much pizza in it. Only 6% alcohol. Instead of a mimosa, I have a mama mango. That wasn't as horrible as I thought it'd be for Moscato. Moscato's delicious, babe. It's all about in the eyes of the beholder. beholder. All right, next. What are you doing right now? I'm trying to screw this in there. Excuse me? <laughs> you wanna you wanna push it in? It's hard. Terrani Sparsi. I could be mispronouncing it. It's from Misa Manfarado, Italy. Here, I got it from there. OMG. You always go too far in. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> Gross! It's his problem. My brother, <laughs> nasty. You said it. Yeah, oh, but you like went there. Me? You went there. You both did. You're the one that literally said to your brother just now, you always go too far in. With the wine cork! How do we know what you're talking about? <laughs> Maybe he calls his wiener a wine cork. <laughs> <laughs> You ready for the wine cork, baby? You give me some wine cork. Can we not talk about my brother in bed? Gnarly. I'm gonna, cork, I'm gonna give you a cork in. I wish I would have rinsed out the mango. It smells very mango-y. Yeah. There's so many beautiful legs. Whoa. Monferrato. It's very rich. It's almost too bold for me. Yeah, it's a kind of bold. Tastes but it's like, smooth. It tastes like wine. This one was probably my least favorite. Born, don't stick your cork too far in this time. Okay. You said that he sticks it too far in. Too far in. Y'all take it to such a perverted I level. I wasn't saying that. Our parents divorced at a young age. Sadly, I kind of think I married my brother. It smells like cork. This is from Capania, Italy. My question to the viewers is, are you or are you not supposed to roll your R's in no, Italian? No, you're not, you're not. Not in Italian. I've, I've seen the millions of Italian movies and I'm half Italian. I have tons of Italian relatives and we don't go, we don't roll our R's. <sighs> no, it's not like. They don't purr when they say they are? No. But thanks. I, I, I still feel like there's a rolling of the R. There's not. 
There's no Raleigh. You grew up in San Antonio. Okay, but can I want to I want to vote. I want to poll. Do you think that you're supposed to roll your R's if you're speaking Italian? This uh, Capagna is... Capagna? 13%. Welcome to the legs, welcome to the legs. He's got a This one's good. It tastes like wine. Yeah, probably my favorite, ironically. Save the best for last. I really like this one. What do you think about when you drink I it? I think about the <coughs> Swiss Alps. Swiss? So this is from a product of Italy. Switzerland is directly north of it. Grapes Italy. selected and hand cultivated by Angelo Aldi in the Angelo. hills of Castel Capagno, Capagnano. Oh. Capagnani? Remember we went to Switzerland? The color is an intense ruby red. I love Switzerland. Terra mm. del Volturno. I think they roll their R's. There's like a slight rolling. The wine is called Terre del Volturno. And I really do think that they roll their R's. They don't. So you're saying the actual pronunciation is Terre del Volturno. To a white chick with no accent like you, yeah. So can we try this Joey's? I'm glad we're ending on a high note. Joe and I are such huge Seinfeld fans. I thought we have to do a black and white. Black and white. Bourne's never had a black and white. So I thought that was kind of interesting. I We're think, gonna split it three ways. I think he has. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, this is my brother. Let's talk about your sister. <laughs> it's a black and white. Or chocolate and vanilla. Joe's stage name is Joey. My stage name is my first and my middle name. Everybody thinks that Jolet is my last name. Fun fact of the day, it's my middle name. All right, let's try out Joey's black and white. Mmm, the wine goes good with this. With all of the tartness that we've had, that's really nice. This is awesome. I've had a lot of black and whites in my day, and this is probably oh, one of my favorites. <laughs> Y'all are always taking it to another level. I didn't say anything. Cheers. Cheers. See you later. See you next video. Cheers. I appreciate every single one of you being a part of the channel. Mama Maniacs. Thanks, out. Every Thanks, everybody. What's up, Mama Maniacs? I'm doing a shout out today. It's a very special shout out to Smile is the new color. Right here. Smile is the new color.